friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, then thank you so much for finding me. I really appreciate it if you would stay, subscribe, like, show me some love. And if you've come back, amazing. I'm happy to have you back again, please stay. So today's video is one that I said I was gonna do and then a couple, couple of people on the comments said, yeah, do it. And it's my Sheen try-on haul. So from my previous Sheen haul like a couple of weeks ago, this is the try-on. Sorry it's so late um, and sorry I had a week off filming. Um, and editing and bringing you content it's just the last little push of uni was literally the number one thing to get done and now i'm finally free my toxic relationship with bgu is now officially over so that's what i feel like i've been trapped in um so it's over so i'm free so be prepared for content i asked what you wanted to see the day and i got a, a nice response so i'm making them come true as much as i can but today's video like i said is my sheen try on haul you've seen what clothes i've got so if you want to see what they look like on, then just keep watching. Right, this first dress, well, the only dress I got is a bit of a fail. Okay, so fits nice on the bottom. Oh, my ring lights fell down, wait there. So fits fine on the bottom, like I can move in it, I can groove in it, and get low in it. But it's kind of, it's not really got much shape here. Um, I don't think I like it on me. Obviously, I don't look like the girl in the fucking photo. She had like a waist in here and boobs up here. I don't actually think I'll wear this. If I was to wear it, what I would pair this with are like Converse's um, or chunky like Nike, something like that. Um, I think it's a very casual dress, to be honest. I don't, I don't like this on me. I'm just trying to visualise the time that I would wear this or even like this, and I can't, I can't think of one. Um, so yeah, I don't like this on me. Not because of the way it fits or anything. I just don't, I just don't like it anymore. I've really gone off it. So this one's actually a no. So if any of my friends are watching this and they want it, you can have it. <laughs> now this one is comfy. This is the second dress. There was a second dress. This is comfy. This just feels like pajamas. Um, and I like it on its own, just to wear with some trainers or some cute chunky sandals in the day on holiday um, for a meal um, with a big denim jacket. I would pair it with, I think. Um, and then as it gets a little bit colder chunky boots and a turtleneck underneath like a black like roll neck turtleneck whatever you call them um but i just think this is really nice it's really um easy just to throw on it's really soft it's really comfy and um, the, le the length is absolutely fine even with the slits there's no issues at all there like as you can see do -do 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 -do. <laughs> again like black converses chunky black boots leather jacket denim jacket that's the kind of vibe i'm feeling with this but yeah, this one's nice. This is really comfortable. And um, please know I am filming this after a full day of eating. I'm yet to have my tea. But obviously your body fluctuates throughout the day. So I thought a good time to try, try them on is after some food. Like, is it like the end of the day? Because if they look all right like this, they're going to look okay when my body hasn't got as much food in it. But yeah, that's that one basically. Yeah, I like this one. Um, th I'm keeping this just to throw on. Like... You know on holiday when you've had like a bit of a later day like around the pool or by the beach and you get back and you just want to throw something on quickly and head out for some food, this is that kind of vibe. Or a picnic in England or like beer garden like daytime or something. Yeah, I think it's really cute. Okay, so this is the first top that I'm trying on. Um, I've just got some straight leg jeans on for reference. Um, yeah, I like it. It's very um, comfy. Obviously, I suffer with um, acne on my chest, like mild acne on my chest, so um, <clears throat> it's not great for that. But I think on holiday with some denim shorts, it would look really cute. Like, imagine these are shorts. I have got shorts, but I was thinking for this country at the moment. But the back is like that. Yeah, I feel like it's nice and basic. It's very basic. I like it. I do like this top. This will be getting kept. It's very comfy. Yeah, it's nice. I wish it was a tiny, tiny bit longer. More like that, maybe. But, you know, what can you do? It is nice. So, yeah. I like that for holiday vibes. Defo. Okay, this is one that I thought would just be like, meh. But it's actually really cute. Um, I'd probably wear, like, a bra under it. But not right now. <laughs> so, yeah, this is um, the lilac, like, little floral top kind of style one. Again, nice with jeans, like this. And trainers, really cute or um shorts um in england or on holiday doing a try and hold with 22 inch hair extensions has been a uh, proving quite challenging 
when I stand like that, these jeans make you look like really sticky out. Um, I don't like how the, the thing droops because they're a little bit big. But yeah, anyway, that's we're not on about the jeans, we're on about the top. Yeah, I like the top. It's quite a nice one if you're not really sure what to wear. If I was going to work and going out for tea after, I could chuck this on, I'd be comfy in it all day. So yeah, no, that one actually is quite nice. I was a little bit underwhelmed when it arrived, but it actually is really quite nice. There's a top I was dreading. Well, I regret getting. Look how wide it is. Like, I would wear it tucked in something, and I would probably consider slashing the neck, because just look how wide it goes. But, because it's just too bat wingy, you know what I mean? Like here, I could even wear it like undone with some cycling shorts. But I honestly think this is just gonna become a pajama top look, because it's so baggy. Um, and it's not really got a lot of shape on it for me, so I probably won't wear this out. I'll probably just, has it got a bag? No. Probably just wear this in the house, to be fair. It's not really got um, anything about it. I have another top. Well, I have a couple more tops left, but the orange and blue, like, waterfally top, for the life of me, I cannot get it on, get it on by myself. So if and when I wear it, I'll show you it in whatever video I've got it on because... I can't do it by myself. It's impossible. So whenever I've got a friend around, I'll try it on. And like, yes, yeah, so there'll be one top missing from this haul. I just thought I'd let you know. I suppose if you sort of... The thing is, even if you're tight, it's too top heavy because of the sleeves. So yeah, I'm not a massive, massive fan of this. I can't lie. But it'll be just become like a nice pyjama top. This absolutely stinks. of salt and vinegar crisps. But obviously this was going to look okay. Like, it's like lined. Can you see? Obviously, I'm changing, man. <laughs> My nipples aren't quite relaxed. So, but yeah, just an everyday joggers for work or a top and jeans like this or whatever. Just shook on with some trainers, jacket, bag, that kind of thing. So, not really much I can say about this one, to be fair. It is just a basic brown halter neck top that I will wear with joggers or jeans, basically. I've saved my favourite till last. Um, I've not seen it on. Excuse my nips. Um, I haven't seen it on, so I don't know if I actually like it on me or not. But, yeah, that's really nice. It's backless. So it looks like that. Oh, I like that. Oh, who is she with a new tattoo? Um, yeah, love this. Love the colour. I think that green colour is such a stunning colour for blondes. Um, that are tanned, not like me. I'm yet to tan. But, yeah, this is really comfortable. You probably could get away with a strapless bra because you can put it a bit higher. But it's very 90s vibes. I'm feeling very, yeah, very 90s kind of vibes with this top. Um, this is a contender for tomorrow. Let me put on some leather shorts and see what I think. I'm going bottomless brunch tomorrow. Okay, I don't hate it, but I don't love it either. Like, it can do better, you know? Doesn't look bad, though. These jeans are a tiny bit tight. Jeans, shorts. Primark sizing, I think. So they got the new sizing in where it's that like small, like a 10 to 12 and whatever. But I think, again, since then, they've repositioned it. Like, because every other size 10, literally any item of clothing I get fits me fine, apart from Primarks. So, but I know the next size would have been too small. Uh, too big. So, yeah, I don't hate it with the shorts. But I can definitely do better for tomorrow. Are we going to focus on me? Focus on me. Fo fo focus on me. Please, please focus. Thank you. Right, so. Sheen hold done. I was back in my jumper with some pyjama shorts on. <laughs> Woohoo. And I can't lie, I am very underwhelmed at how they, how they look. I think I'm not going to beat myself up about the way I am or anything like that, like my body or anything. Just because I am a healthy size 10 woman who enjoys eating healthy but also enjoys going out and eating food, you know? And that is normal. And we're in a, and we're in a pandemic where you can't move as much and stuff. So anyway, that's why I'm not going to beat myself up. I think with certain fast fashion websites, the fast fashion industry doesn't care how the outfits look on you. They just mass produce tops, shorts, bottoms, whatever. Um, so you buy them. So they don't care what they look like on the person. Whereas obviously if you go to like a quality store that isn't fast fashion, it's made to fit a human body. Whereas these are just made as clothes and that's it. So Sheen for me actually has turned out to be a little bit disappointing. Um, as you can probably tell throughout the video, my, I go a little bit flat. Don't get me wrong, I've got no fake tan on and I know you girls will get what I'm saying that when you've got tan on you feel so much better with the way your outfit looks and your body looks and everything. And obviously my hair's not done and I've got no makeup on and I've got no tan on top of that. So, um, and I've, I've had a day of eating. But 
that's just what this is just what I look like sometimes you know sometimes I don't like this sometimes I look more glam sometimes I look more tan sometimes I look slimmer sometimes I look bigger because I'll eat or whatever so um if you ever do a try on uh, of clothes you bought you buy and you feel the way I'm feeling now or felt now don't beat yourself up about it because like I just said so many factors come into it and fast fashion is not designed with the customer at heart it's designed with their pockets getting lined at the end of the day they just mass produce clothes and they don't care what it looks like on people and if it looks great on you it's a bonus for them you know what I mean so yeah that's not me dissing sheen at all as a company itself it's just fast fashion in general that's how it works um, I know loads of my friends love sheen stuff and maybe I just got an unlucky streak or maybe when I try them on again later after I've fake tanned I feel like a different person who knows so that is going to go ahead and conclude my sheen try on haul um thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next video bye